All right. Uh, next, I want to talk a little bit about the black elite in this country. Um, I know before um, the Charleston thing happened, it, it appears now that uh, the blacks elite seem to be they got cut off, caught off guard as far as um, uh, the shooting in Charleston went. Um, and now I guess they're trying to like backtrack and say, hey, well, wait a minute, maybe this racism thing is is uh, is bad, you know. Let's not, let's try to um, uh, let's come out and say racism is bad now. And even before they say, oh, everything's just fine here in America. We white folks, we get along good with the white folks. You know, now, since the incident happened in Charleston, they said, wait a minute, uh, John Calhoun, he was a racist, and, and you know, they're going around desecrating uh, 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 white folks' uh, 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 um, statues and stuff. I mean, what, what's going on here? I mean, it seems kind of strange that, and if you try to research the history of what actually, you know, went on during slavery time, blacks actually owned slaves too. So, but after the Civil War, I guess there was some, uh, that was mainly was covered up that blacks actually owned slaves, mainly because it was trying to, uh, I guess, demonize um, the South, you know, uh, the people in the South. They tried to demonize them as being, oh, uh, y'all don't like black people and this and that. And in fact, blacks actually own slaves. 